More than 100 police departments across the state took part in the National Drug Take Back Day, the DA's initiative providing a safe and convenient opportunity for people to drop off their prescription medication, which could have dire consequences in the wrong hands. Hello. One by one, Granite Staters made their way to the parking lot of Elliott Urgent Care at River's Edge All right. for the 20th annual Prescription Drug Take Back Day. Just from the locations that I've been at already today, we're seeing an incredible turnout. It's, it's non-stop vehicles pulling through. At 120 locations across New Hampshire, people could drop off any amount of unused prescription medications, no questions asked. Those will be pills that won't be in a medicine cabinet, um, that won't be misused. Um, and so this is one important step at addressing addiction in New Hampshire. Last October, the DA collected nearly 1 million pounds of unused prescription drugs nationwide medications that often go forgotten and many times unused. But it's important to know that after those high levels of pain are gone, that those medicines need to be safely disposed of. While there's no way to quantify how many lives are impacted by events like this, Manchester police have seen firsthand the potential damage these prescriptions can cause should they fall into the wrong hands. It's good for my officers that and you know the personnel, the, the, the medics, the fire department that go to these overdose calls and all walks of life, right? I mean, that's, I think that's what gets lost a lot of times is, is addiction and overdose can touch any, any family. And drop-off sites are available year-round. For a list of places nearest to you, find this story on our website or mobile app.